already. Well, I, don't, I just don't know how to start it. I never know the first few words to say. Hey guys, this just sounds so fucking lame. Hey guys, how's it going? So today we are on our way to Lake Windermere. Here's Connor, say hi. And Craig in the back. The big plan today is to head down to Lake Windermere to do my two hour qualifying swim and essentially see if I can qualify for swimming the English Channel. Today, the real question mark is whether or not I can, I can withstand the qualifying swim, which is two hours in water under 16 degrees. Obviously, we have to be doing this without a wetsuit, um, so you're just in your regular swimming costume. So there's no assistance there as far as buoyancy, there's no assistance there as far as staying warm with neoprene. Um, so those are kind of the main challenges that we're going to be facing and that's something that I've been kind of gearing towards as part of my training. A lot of my training has been done up in Scotland and it's been really good but to be honest it's been so cold up there that we haven't really been able to do much long swimming. So the longest I've managed so far is about an hour up in Scotland at about 12 degrees. So the reason that we are heading down south slightly today is that it's just going to be much better conditions. So hoping for water around about 14 or 15 degrees and we'll see if that makes a difference but we're really prepared we've kind of been speaking to a few experts that have done this before around feeding and staying warm and we've got Craig and Connor here to help as far as support in and out of the water so feeling pretty confident and, and yeah I guess Stay yeah. tuned to see if I can manage. They're really tough and they're really rough. Are we ready? <laughs> ready. Let's go. Let's go do this. But there's something inside of you that says, I just have to follow that. Because you don't know what you're going to be. You're not going to Good to get in. Good. So there's no stopping us. He said, knock yourself out. Um, so, yeah, public jet is there, so we can feed from there. We can stick up this coast. It gets busy down that end. Yeah, it's going to. Because that's what we did at Gladhouse, was, or what I did at Gladhouse was like, I'll swim around the island and back. I think it was going to take me like 20 minutes, 20 minutes, 40 minutes to do a oh, loop. Right, yeah. So, by the time I came back, I was gassed because I hadn't been able to feed. Like, don't go into the middle because you get run over by the ferries. Yeah, all right. So we can we can maybe go in the second day, I think. All right, let's go check that. Nice and clear. I've literally got no excuse not to be able to do this, mate. This looks lovely. You keen? Feeling good? Yeah, I mean I haven't felt the water yet, so it's a lot more manageable. 100 percent It's gonna still get cold. Oh here, we're fucking fine. <laughs> we're fine. What do you think the temperature is? We're fine. Trusty thermometer? Perfect. What's the game plan? Uh the game plan is from here. Get changed, get ready. Set up our feeding station at the end of the jetty, which is going to be consisted of like energy gels, water, flat coke, sugar, and carbs that I can take in really quickly, and then essentially scope out the swimming area. So I'm going to do maybe about a 500 meter loop to the right hand side, come back for a feed, do the same again in the opposite direction, and from there understand where it's going to be best to be doing the majority of the swimming during the tour of swimming. Get the boys in to help me throughout the swim would be is going to be really good as well. There's a lot riding on today. If I can't complete this tour of swim the channel really is not going to go ahead. Now the other four boys in London and New York have all done theirs. They said it was extremely difficult, so I do have a bit of a heads up of what it's going to be like, but you know, I need to do this today, otherwise we've, we've not got enough time to do it again. Let's no do more. it. Right.
right, I'm doing this. Oh man, it's not warm. All right, mate, Connor, I'll see you in like 15 minutes. That was like a thousand meters. Right. Bang on. Yes. So, just a seven more of those. <laughs> That'd be a good amount. Can you chuck me if there's one that's warm? It's not me. It's not that cold, to be honest. There's colder bits. That is disgusting. <laughs> oh. But that's nice. That's good temperature. How long did that take you? Um, it was just under 14 minutes, I think. Perfect for. Uh, feeding quite nice. That bit's like so much warmer than in Scotland, but there are bits that gets colder. And then a cloud went over the a cloud went over the, the sun and it went black. <laughs> I freaked out, man. <laughs> I like stopped. Oh. Oh. Cheers. All right. Okay. Well, I'll do another one and then I'll see, I'll see you. Later. Later. All right. Have a good Bye. one. Starting to change colour. Oh yeah. Oh my feet are so numb. I have another hot drink ready for you. Alright. Pretend I was doing that the whole way. <laughs> Twenty minutes later. Two hours, we're done. We're done. Oh, you're swimming the channel. Easy. How do you feel? I feel surprisingly good. I feel happy. I did it. Happy that it's over. I think I'm colder than I think I am. No, this is the best state I've seen you in. Like, yeah. each other cold dips and cold swims. It, just, it was manageable that I was able to like swim the whole way continuously because that, that actually helps. Whereas before it's been so cold that I can never really get into like a rhythm. But that I was able to just kind of keep plodding up and down. That was good having you two in there as well. But I just felt like, like my shoulders are sore. My yeah. body is sore because I actually exerted more energy and did more training but it's that difference in a few degrees and feeding properly and feeding properly was really good very happy that's that's done next step is the channel channel here we come it's official we're going we're going to dover <laughs> going to cali going to france it's an old one. Oh, thank you.
Well, I, don't, I just don't know how to start it. I never know the first few words to say. Hey guys, it just sounds so fucking plain. Alright, guys. <laughs> Your posture, if you look back at this, then. Look at him, like, <laughs> he seems to have fucking steak for a moment. It's the water. <laughs> I give it my all. One hundred percent got that in. Why are you running? Why are you running? 